Go get your martial arts long staff. It can be Chinese, Japanese, Korean, Indian style, doesn't really matter. It can be a lightsaber from the movies. It could even be a long stick. Go get it, we're gonna train now. Spin, strikes, and blocks, follow me. Before we get started, please remember to hit subscribe. And then along the way, leave me some comments, hit like. I'll get better when you do that. You'll get better when you do that too. Start with a nice and easy hand over hand rotation. And then go the other way. And now you'll do an assisted wrist roll. So you're just using your bottom hand to help push it around your wrist. Your hand opens, thumb gets out of the way, and then you're pushing it across the back of the hand. Once you've done this a few times, try it without the assist. Trust yourself that if you don't get it right away and you drop it, you're gonna keep picking it up. You know you'll get better if you do it that way. And now the other way. Assisted first, and now unassisted. For a rotation around your body, this is kind of a big move. Allow it to go where it wants to go at first. Switch hands. Now switching hands. As you're switching, your hand is gonna come across the opposite side of your body. It's my right hand, left side of my body, and then it turns up. As it turns up, the other hand is gonna come up behind and just grab it. This hand gets out of the way. Just comes up behind it. It's ready, grabs behind. Now, reversing your spin. You're pulling in the opposite direction of what you've done already. When you start this from the beginning, it might feel different. You might not be as strong. You'll get there with lots of practice. Think of the long game. How good are you gonna be when you don't quit and you practice every day? How good will you be a few months from now, a few years from now, 10 years from now? Now switching hand to hand. And this, like the spin, is the opposite of what you've done before. This is now my left hand. On the same side, on my left side, my right hand is gonna come in front of it. On the right side, my left hand comes in front of the right. My right hand gets out of the way. Bring it in front. Now your basic blocks and strikes. You're gonna start with your hands in a push-up position. You're gonna push up at an angle in front of the head, blocking your forehead. The staff, the other person's staff, or maybe the punch is coming right to your face, you're gonna push, lift, either stopping at the top or catching it as it's coming in. You're gonna stop them from hitting you in the face. Same is true, they're grabbing you on the body. Maybe they're striking, hitting you with a knife, pushing down and away from you. Pull all the way into your chest, practice this way, all the way in and down. Down at an angle, up at an angle, like doing push-ups. Start first with just the range of motion and then forcefully add your breathing. Exhale hard. Now, the punch is coming in to the middle or the strike with the weapon, you're gonna bring your staff up. So the one hand is a little bit higher than your eyebrow. You're gonna clear across your body. You're gonna turn, the other hand is up. It's coming in here, this is pushing it out of the way. Turn, block, block. It 
Again with the breath. And now some strikes to the temple, to the throat, breaking the jaw. The end of your staff is with striking. It's like a punch. The staff is coming over your elbow to protect the elbow. Some styles bring it under. If you wanna strike, bring it under, if that's your style, do it that way. I like to bring it over. Protect that joint, the nerves, the elbow, the bone. Now to the knee. It's like punching down into their solar plexus. And now, straight punch to the ribs. To the face. To the ribs. And to the knee. Now for your bonus move. You've already done this, but you're gonna do it now in a different way. I want you to pull the staff away from you in that reverse spin, and I want you to keep it head high. You're gonna slowly increase your speed. 